Afro lovers, welcome back. This is the entertainment news update on Afrobeat Global TV. I know you guys have missed me because it's been so long you actually saw my face. Mm. <laughs> Don't worry, it's nothing serious basically. It's just all about the pandemic and the general lockdown. Hope you guys have been staying safe during this time. I'm sure you guys will be anyways. <laughs> You know why I'm always here now, you know, to give you all the entertainment news all around the world. I know you guys have missed me for that gist, but don't worry, I'm back here. Before we go right into that gist, because I have a lot of stories for you today. Let's go for a short break. We'll be right back. Guys, first of all, we are going to be saying a very big congratulations to Casey, that's the Limpopo singer, and his family. They welcomed their third child yesterday, which happens to be actually their second baby boy. Also, yesterday was his wife's birthday night, throwing in the suggestion what do you think he should get for his wife, you know, based on the new gift that she just gave to him. If you ask me, I'll say car, but you know, they actually have a lot of cars, but whatever you think he should give his wife for this beautiful gift, you know, you should just drop it right there in the comment section. So when it comes to living a flamboyant lifestyle and showing sure off, you're actually going to know the big brother of Casey, that's Imoni. He's known for this and also you can see him around going with police escort just because he's really influential. But the inspector general of police, that's Muhammad Adamu already, ordered the probing of Imoni looking into what his source of wealth is. According to him, he's a forwarding and clearing agent. But we really don't know how this is going to end. We just hope that this ends really well. Also, the inspector general ordered that six police may be withdrawn from him and he shouldn't go around with so much escort we just think this is going to end really well but whatever you think about the situation you should just drop it right there in the comment section so believe me guys when i say even in the lockdown things are still going down so people are not even feeling this pandemic at all lillian Esoro is one of them she's an actress also she's a, she's the ex-wife of ubi franklin and she posted a picture of a new whip although she never said anything but you know we are proco people eh? we don't capture them and see that most of our friends have come congratulated her on her page. What do you expect? We think she got this car. But whatever it is, congratulations, girl. And you know what? You're just the boss. Let nobody say otherwise. <laughs> Don't worry, guys. I will be back with a few more gist. Let's go for a quick break. back guys so i know a lot of celebrities are acting at see if this pandemic is not really affecting them financially so big brother niger kafi came out to say that she turned an offer worth eight million naira from a bleaching cream company just because it didn't go well with her identity a lot of people have jumped on the post and are, you know telling her that why would she do such a thing and some people think that she's just trying to chase clout and some people think she's really sensible you know thinking about her future and her identity in the nearest future whatever you think about this you can just drop it right there in the comment section but if you ask me i wouldn't turn eight millionaire down for anything i wouldn't <laughs> to all the movie lovers out there it is really sad to announce the death of chibo zobosa that's the actress who played auntie tenuke in tv series tinsel also she starred in the blockbuster movie that's living in bondage you know she died at the age of 52 after suffering from diabetes and high blood pressure can we just observe a one minute silence for her Just hope that our gentle soul rests in perfect peace. Anyway, guys, that's going to be all for now. Do well to follow us across all social media platforms at Afrobeat Global TV on Instagram, on Twitter, also on our YouTube. You can also check on for latest news updates on our website. That's our blog at www.afrobeatglobal.com. Also, don't forget to follow your girl at Lyo underscore L A Y O R H underscore. Even if you not tell me, I know I'm doing well. <laughs> I'll be back next week with more amazing. Is in Apocalypse. Don't worry, I'm your number one plug. I'm going nowhere. Also, guys, please don't forget to stay safe. You know, follow all the safety precautions. Please, I love you so much. Please stay safe. Thank you, guys. See you next week. Bye.